So all those uh, intro videos were generated uh, by the latest uh, stable media diffusion. Today I want to do a tutorial on how to use that using Comfy UI. Before that, I also recommend that you to read their blog of introduction. I think they include uh, some very detailed uh, description, also some great examples that you can take a look. So the first step is to install the Conf UI or update the Conf UI if you have the, the old installation. See my previous video for the details. Secondly, you would need to download the several models. There's one for each. There's one, the normal two second, and there's another XT version, which generates videos of three seconds. Which I really recommend is to using the 16-bit format, it will save you lots of disk space, so it only takes about 4.5 gigabytes. So after you download that, you will need to put those into the normal location, which is under the Comfy UI. You go to the Models, Checkpoints, and then you can start uh, Comfy UI as usual. You can activate your Anaconda environment or Python virtual environment. And do the Python main.py. So once you have the Comfy UI, you will need to get the workflow. There's the one official workflow that you can download. They provided it as a JSON file. You can download that. So after you download that, you can drag that onto the Comfy UI interface. So as you can see, it's a, it's a quite uh, simple. You will need to select uh, the checkpoint. We can, we can see the generated video, it looks uh, quite nice. It took about uh, one minute to generate uh, a two second video. All right, so next, we would like to try to demo the longer video generating. It should require you to select uh, the XT model. Remember the file we downloaded previously.
So lastly, what I would like to do is to utilize the powerful Curve UI to combine the text to image with stable video diffusion. So make sure that you select the image size. This is a normal text to image generating pipeline. And uh, you connect the image together with the video diffusion. So this way you can start from your prompt text to image and then from image to video. I really like Comfy UI's flexibility. So you can basically connect the different uh, uh, workflow together. So I think this can be really powerful for automation. I will uh, include uh, my workflow in the Discord server. If you are interested, please join that. We can see that uh, it uses about uh, nine gigabytes of VRAM. So I would say that if you have a 12 gigabytes GPU, it would be sufficient to run this model. All right, so we see that the results has been completed and we see the generated image. This is the SDXL model. And then on the right side is the generated video. So you are basically beginning from the uh, text description, which uh, created uh, the image. And then the image was fed in to the stable video diffusion. You were able to create this uh, really nice uh, image. So I'm saving my workflow to a JSON text file. So I will share this. Okay, so I think uh, um, this is a really powerful model. I think uh, lots of people have really had a good uh, results. So I highly recommend that uh, you can give it a try and uh, uh, feel free to let me know if you have any question. I think it's still early. I'm very excited uh, for tomorrow, for the future. I really look forward to that. Please uh, subscribe to my channel if you want to keep updated about uh, the latest uh, advancement in the AI in stable diffusion, in the stable video, in all the AI field. I'm happy to share my knowledge with you. Look forward to see you again. Goodbye.